Hello, and welcome to Two For You, Two Minutes to Live and Lead with Intention. Today we're going to talk to you about Naomi Eisenberger's research about pain. And she's found that our brains, the neural circuits in our brains, the same area lights up when we feel physical pain as when we feel social rejection. So think of, so social rejection, for example, so if you have uh, maybe negative feedback around something or if you, uh, someone's forgotten in a list of thank yous or someone feels like their work isn't really valued, your brain can respond the same way as if you break a leg. Oh, so I've broken a wrist. I mean, that's a lot of pain yeah. that you feel when that happens. Right, so you break your wrist and your, and your brain tells your body, okay, we need to do something, like something isn't right here, so it sends some pain signals. And that's the same as when we have social rejection. It's telling you something isn't quite right, we need to make an assessment, make an adjustment. So your body is telling, your, telling your brain is telling your body that we need to make an adjustment. So for those of us that work in communities or um, consider ourselves leaders or trying to be leaders, how do we apply this research in, in our communities? Yeah, I think about, you know, there's so many times that we're out and about in community and we're engaging with people and maybe we're at a community event or something else going on and, you know, you are talking to your friends or your colleagues and you notice somebody across the room, maybe you even make a little bit of eye contact and you look away because you're like, oh, I just want to make eye contact with that person. And so you can make some choices and the choices you make can affect that person's brain and your brain about social rejection. So you can choose to either hang out back here and kind of see what happens to that person and let them fumble around a little bit, or you could go over there and invite the person in. So that's our challenge to you this month is take that step, welcome someone in, reduce that pain so you can truly live and lead with intention.